Hi guys, good morning. Today is Friday and it's my off day. It's also a new month, so I'm getting another chance to go out again. And of course, I'll be going to Lulu shopping. So last month we were given one hour to shop and uh, we complained a little bit that it's not enough. So we were added another 30 minutes. So today we'll be going out for one hour and 30 minutes. And uh, from the last uh, video that I posted about going out to Lulu, somebody asked me, oh, please show us what you bought. But uh, then I, it was too late. I had already unpacked. But uh, after this shopping trip, I'm going to do a small haul. I'm not buying any special stuff, just food stuff. I mean, at this point in time, I'm not going to shop for clothes or any other things, just the essentials, uh, the basic needs. But anyway, give the people what they want. So yes, you're going to be having a haul after I come back. So right now it's about 10.15 and the bus is leaving at 10.30. So before I get late, let me go and catch it because it waits for nobody. It's 10.30 and it needs to go. And uh, I just need to verify one thing that my iteras application is working. Oh, it is. Yes, it is green. If that is not working, I'm not allowed into the bus nor into the supermarket. So that would be very sad. But luckily it is. So let me go. Catch you later. So I've just returned from my shopping trip from Lulu and as I promised I would do a haul because as I said from the last video somebody asked me to show you what I had purchased from when I went shopping. So I have one large bag over here. <laughs> this one of course, yeah, from Lulu and yes let's let's do this. So good. grain bread I love this bread so much I don't eat bread much but when I do eat bread then this is what I go for it has oatmeal I don't know what else, what are the ingredients like multi seeds like oats brown lid seeds uh, whatever so many things so I love it and then uh, of course for breakfast I usually have oat, oatmeal so I bought two packs what else some little snack i'm trying to avoid snacking i've been snacking a lot until i feel like i'm getting addicted to sugar so i just bought something a little bit but not so much i bought some beef beef for the bones uh, local beef here this one needs to go straight to the fridge and put it here then what else do I have? Mm -hmm. um, a tray or a pack of flavored yogurt because I like for my midday snack or something or for topping up on my oatmeal. So yeah, this just a pack of six. Then some frozen items here. These are like uh, what? Potato wedges. Because 
The potatoes that you have here, the like raw potatoes, if you try to fry them, maybe if you're having a craving for french fries or whatever, they tend to blacken. I don't know, they're weird. So if we want to make french fries or wedges, then you just go for this ready-made that you fry in the oil for like three to five minutes and then they are going to go. So this I have. But just this and also some frozen, uh, whatever this, mixed vegetables and green peas and stuff like that because we don't, don't get so much of this like fresh from the market unless you buy frozen. So this I got two parts. What else did I have? I also bought some laundry detergent, two packs. I bought some super glue, uh, my hula hoop, I think uh, one plus uh, got damaged, so I need to go stick it up with this. What else? And forgive me for the whatever. Uh, this is that smoke detector. I'm downstairs, but usually nowadays from my room upstairs, that is not happening. And then lastly, I have uh, fruit. So I bought some tomatoes. I didn't buy so many tomatoes. These four tomatoes are almost like 120 shillings. Like one tomato is 40 shillings. So like. I couldn't buy so many of them, but this was the only ones that were available in the market. We call them uh, organic tomato beef, whatever that is. So they are very expensive. I couldn't buy so many of them. I will buy from our local shop here. I think the price would be more reasonable. Then I also bought some oranges for vitamin C, of course, with the pandemic. Uh, some apples. They are so big and uh, yeah, yummy. Also some lemons for again vitamin C. Uh, lots of carrots. I've just come to fall in love lately with the baked vegetables, baked carrots and potatoes. So that's why I got so many of them. And last, last but not least, of course, bananas for potassium because of course I've been working out a lot lately and uh, it just it really helps. And that's basically it. Lastly, I have um, what? Lastly, I have bought a crate. Is it a tray or a crate of eggs? So that of thirty eggs, farm fresh. And that's about it. Because I didn't buy so many, so much stuff. Because from my last shopping, which was just like a. Maybe two weeks ago, I bought uh, a lot of dry goods that are upstairs in a box, so I didn't need to restock on. I did not need to restock on that. So, yeah, that is what was in my shopping bag today. And uh, yeah, I hope <laughs> you enjoyed our local products in the market over here. I'll just give you a glimpse. Yeah, that is what we have. Let me put it a little bit far. So that's basically it. Yeah, so that's basically it. That is all that I got from the market. And uh, yeah, so this should be able to last me a couple of days until uh, we are able to go out again. As I told you guys, we only have a chance to go out once in a month. And uh, yeah, I know most of this stuff won't last a month, but uh, when I run out, then I will see how to survive. But at least, like eggs and tissue and laundry detergent, I don't, I know those ones will last. So yeah, that's it. Maybe when I go upstairs, I'll just show you what the dry ingredients that I have. Maybe some of you are curious to see the kind of products that we use here in Qatar. Like, uh, I don't know if this is international or not, I don't know. Well, but of course at the back it's written in Arabic yeah so yes I will go upstairs and I will show you what else I have there that I bought from the last time that you guys wanted to see but did not get the chance and then yeah this is uh, yogurt that we have here of course it's raw A 
whatever yeah that's a company so this is flavored yogurt usually low fat but very sweet and thick so yeah that's it we'll go upstairs and we'll finish up from there so guys to finish off i'll just show you the items that i got uh, from last time mostly uh, the dry ingredients that i have not used yet because of course some of them are in the kitchen and in use so no point of showing you those but i did buy semolina this is uh, what we use to cook ugali with and this one is brown from lulu i also got more oats some basmati rice this is from india tea we kenyans luyas we do love tea uh, some pasta, uh, some cooking oil, some white sugar that sometimes I use for baking, some salt, a kg of salt, um, okay, more cooking oil, this I had from before, more sugar from Lulu, some dal from India, some chili powder because I like spicy food. Having lived here in Qatar, I've gotten used to that way of life. Vanilla essence, of course, again for baking. Um, some condensed milk. More rice, basmati rice from Lulu. Yeah, and... Uh, some other stuff that i've already started using so that's it guys um yeah when i go shopping it's just the basic essentials uh at this point in time i have tried to avoid unnecessary items like whatever what i don't need and of course for food you just have no choice because we have to continue surviving and thriving so guys that's it and um yeah, so that's it. I hope you enjoyed this uh, shopping haul. These are the items that I just showed you. I have put them. Oh, sorry. Let me lower this a little bit. Anyway, so these are the items that I bought. Sorry, I put on top of my bed because I don't have any other surface. So these ones are from the last time. And yeah, so that's it, guys. Uh, that is what I bought from last time plus okay of course some other times that are some other items that are already in use and this should take me through uh to a couple of months because uh it's right now we only have one chance of going out shopping and we are never sure of the next time you know things might change anytime so we just try to stock up uh to to be safe <laughs> with this situation it is so much better to have just food that you can survive on in case things change again so suddenly so that's it guys i hope you enjoyed this uh shopping haul from lulu <laughs> just a change of content and it's something that somebody or some of you requested that i do and uh, i hope you enjoy it yes and uh remember to subscribe to this channel if you haven't and uh, i will see you on another video bye